Brits could face travel hell as Ryanair threatened to cut UK flights. Ryanair warned the capacity of domestic UK flights could be cut within the next year. The bargain airline bosses are putting pressure on the government to get a plan in place in 365 days. Chief Marketing Officer Kenny Jacobs said, Airlines plan a year in advance, so that means we need to know how is this going to work by the end of February start of March 2018. Please British government, please EU- How is this new arrangement going to work? Brit airlines are able to fly across other countries' airspace. But the open skies agreement between Britain, the EU and the US is no longer guaranteed when the UK triggers Article 50 next month. Theresa May has promised that the European Court of Justice, who govern the policy, will have no influence over Britain after our exit. Mr Jacobs reiterated the government need to start moving very quickly to put a plan in place otherwise the airline may have to make significant capacity cuts. He explained, can it be open skies? The answer is no, because open skies is governed by the European Court of Justice. Can it be the Swiss model? And the answer is no, because the Swiss model also respects and is under EU law, under the laws of the ECJ. Can it be the European Common Aviation Area? As it stands, it can't be the ICA because that is also governed by EU law and the ECJ. So you're looking at individual bilaterals between the UK and separate countries in Europe or a new agreement between the UK and all of Europe which would be something very different, or you're looking at something else. These are all of the options. If we don't know by this time next year, then what are airlines going to do? Are we going to have to make significant capacity cuts? Ryanair have already announced their plans to move business away from the UK in the wake of Brexit and the chief marketing officer believes the best outcome would be for the UK to remain in open skies.